So today, NetGeek Pro is going to show you how to set up your very own self-hosted WordPress blog in under three minutes. We'll be using HostGator this time, and we'll even give you a unique promo code to allow you to save 25% off the total price, which can be as much as over $73 saved. So let's begin from the homepage of NetGeek Pro, found at www.netgeekpro.com. So we're going to start by clicking the banner and head over to HostGator. The banner is found over here on the right hand side of the page, but a link to this can also be found in the description area of the video. Okay, once clicked, we'll be taken to the home page and we'll begin by pressing Get Started Now. Now we have to choose our plan. Pretty much the only two you need to consider are Hatchling and Baby. Major differences being Hatchling allows just a single domain, whereas Baby allows unlimited domains. In my experience, if you have one blog, you usually then want to start a second, so having unlimited domains really does save you the money. So let's go ahead and select the baby plan. First off, we have to choose a domain name. If you don't have an available domain name choice, HostGator will let you know. This one is available, so I'm going to select that. Next, we choose the hosting plan. It's already selected baby. You can choose the billing cycle. Um, the longer you sign up for, the more the savings are. So let's go for 36 months. Um, then we'll enter a username, a security pin, and enter in our billing information. I'm going to skip past this for now. We're going to go ahead and deselect all of the extras. If you need to learn about these, there is another video available at NetGeek Pro that will explain all of this for you. So the most important part now, the coupon code. Let's get the biggest saving possible. So let's delete that and go ahead and write NetGeek Pro. Push validate. There we go. So we have an even bigger saving now. Um, as you can see, we've saved over $73 today. Um, depending on how long you set your hosting for, you'll save a different amount. So before you go ahead and push checkout now, you will have to select that you have read the terms and conditions. Now I'm going to go ahead and blank out the screen as I go in and fill in my billing information, select my username, following the parameters, and also selecting that security pin. So once you've done that, slide back down, make sure terms and conditions is selected, and click checkout now. And I'll see you on the other side. Let's go ahead and close this refer a friend offer. You have this welcome message, and we're going to go to go to the customer portal. Now you would have been sent the login details in a welcome email. So go ahead, check your email and log in with the credentials they gave you. Okay, so we're taken to the customer portal. So we're gonna click hosting. We're gonna click get started with WordPress today. It'll open a new tab. We'll click one click installs found at the top. We'll scroll down, we'll click install WordPress and we'll go ahead and do the free install. Next we'll select our blog name, we'll leave the path empty, and go ahead and enter your credentials. Again, I'm going to blank out these details, but once I've entered in them, I will click Install WordPress. Okay, then you'll be taken to a screen where, as you can see, there'll be an offer, we'll close down, and your install is complete. So let's go ahead and check it out. Let's open a new window and visit the domain name that we bought. And there we go. We've successfully installed WordPress in under three minutes.